Welcome to the EU7000 IS Generator Wireless Remote Starter Installation video. In this video, you will be shown how to install the receiving unit into an EU7000 IS generator, followed by the phone pairing process. Once installed and paired, you will be able to start and stop the generator from up to 75 feet away by using either the included fob transmitter or your Bluetooth-enabled smartphone. Generator exhaust contains poisonous carbon monoxide gas that can build up to dangerous levels in closed areas. Breathing carbon monoxide can cause unconsciousness or even death. Never run the generator in a closed or even partially closed area where people may be present. For additional information about the capabilities or installation of the remote starter kit, refer to the Frequently Asked Questions page found on our website or contact your local Honda Power Equipment dealer. Before installation, let's see what is included. Included in the wireless remote starter kit is one wireless transmitter remote fob, one receiving unit, one cable tie, and the installation instructions. Prior to installation, download the Honda EU7000IS remote app from the Apple Store or Google Play. The app is required to use both the transmitter fob as well as the smartphone. Before installing the receiving unit into the generator, make sure the main switch is turned off and the generator has cooled. Lift the generator folding handles up and away from the front of the generator and lock them in place. Use a screwdriver and loosen the battery maintenance cover screw and then set the cover aside. Locate the short connector. Press on the connector release tab and remove the short connector. Note, do not discard the short connector as it will be required to start the generator if the wireless receiver is ever removed. Insert the receiving unit tab, wire side facing down and to the bracket as shown. Plug the receiving unit connector into the 8-pin connector. Press firmly until the connector is seated. Use a supplied cable tie to attach the unused short connector to the receiving unit. Tighten the cable tie and trim the excess. Reinstall the battery maintenance cover and tighten the screw cover securely. Before pairing a smartphone, be sure that the transmitter fob has been programmed. To begin pairing the transmitter fob, turn the generator main switch to the on position and then to the off position five times within five seconds. On the fifth time, leave the switch in the on position. Within 30 seconds, press and release the A button once until the indicator light on the fob flashes red. Now press and hold the start and stop buttons at the same time until the red indicator flashes. After two seconds, the indicator light illuminates green, indicating the transmitter fob is now paired to the generator. To begin pairing a smartphone, verify that the Bluetooth function is turned on. Open the Honda EU7000 IS remote app on the smartphone. Turn the generator main switch to the on position and then to the off position five times within five seconds. On the fifth time, leave the switch in the on position. Within 30 seconds, begin the pairing process by following the on-screen prompts in the app on the smartphone. The phone is now paired to the generator. To start the generator using a smartphone, the generator main switch must be in the on position with all appliances turned off. Open the Honda EU7000 IS remote app on the smartphone. Once open, tap and hold the power icon for two seconds or until the green circle is complete. The warning regarding proper usage and safety is shown on screen. If the generator is in a safe place to operate, then press I understand, start generator. To stop the generator, with the Honda EU7000 IS remote app open, simply press the power icon for two seconds or until the red circle is complete. The generator stops. To start the generator using the transmitter fob, the generator main switch must be turned in the on position with all appliances turned off. With the transmitter fob in hand, press the A button once. The indicator light flashes orange, then stays illuminated. Press and release the start button to start the generator. Once started, the indicator light illuminates green. To stop the generator, press the A button once. The indicator light flashes orange, then stays illuminated. Press and release the stop button. The generator stops. Although it is necessary to pair both the smartphone and the transmitter fob for either to work, it is not necessary to have both the smartphone and transmitter fob to operate the wireless remote functions. Verify that the smartphone app has been closed if you intend to use the fob to start the generator. For additional information about the capabilities or installation of the remote starter kit, refer to the Frequently Asked Questions page on our website or contact your local Honda Power Equipment dealer.